Let's check out the food finds at Aldi this week. Lots more fun St. Patrick's Day stuff is coming out, like these cookie dough and mint chocolate chip ice creams. They also had leprechauns, which are so cute. You want to try the best chips ever, you need to try these Kios chips. They're straight from Ireland, and they even have a sour cream and shamrock flavor. Lucky Charms that turns your milk green. And they also brought back the Lucky Crunch snack mix, which has popcorn, cookies, and pretzels. These St. Patrick's Day truffles are new this year. I'm really excited to try this. It reminds me of a shamrock shake from McDonald's. Some St. Patrick's Day mini cupcakes. And of course, you know, they have to have the nasty cookies. There are also a lot of other fun freezer finds this week, like this dill pickle fish sandwich. I 100% grabbed this mini stuffed pancakes. They also have a hazelnut flavor. Two new flavors of stuffed crust pizza. When we tried the other stuffed crust pizza, we actually really liked it. I think these look good. Don't get your hopes up. They're not great. They're a lot of breading. Just trust me. They also had a bag of muscle meat, which looks like it would be so easy to throw into pasta. They also brought back the pork schnitzel, which is always a fan favorite. There's a chicken fettuccine alfredo bowl. Tito's O'Brien. I love these for a quick and easy dinner side. They also had swai fillets, which I haven't had these, but a lot of people hate on it. Finally found the Sicilian pizza for $2 off. They also had new lamb. I've never seen this one before. I'm going to give it a try. This looks so good. Definitely had to try it. Grab the confetti one, so we'll see how it is. I love rye bread. I foresee some corned beef sandwiches in my future. Sun chips are also amazing. I had these Garfield themed nacho pop chips. So the favorite mac and cheese at our house is the shells and cheese. So I might need that. They also had animal crackers and mini Oreos, some Marvel fruit snacks and SpongeBob fruit snacks. I don't know the deal is with these Oreos, but they looked interesting. Oh, and now I see they have Pop Rocks in them. They're also a host of strawberry cupcakes and some mint chocolate cream sandwich cookies. I'm gonna share a video of a fun drink that I'm gonna make with this white cranberry strawberry. There is also Campbell's soup, an Italian wedding, and tortilla. Fun fact, my last name is Campbell. I also had these two other soups and I'm definitely gonna try them. I am intrigued. I know a lot of people don't like these, but I actually really like these tortellini, especially the truffle one. They also had two new flavors of mac and cheese mini cereal. I feel like this would be good to make like Rice Krispie treats and these two flavors of cereal bars. Let's check out the home finds at Aldi this week. So lots of cleaning products this week. The Cyclonic Vacuum is back. I need reviews on this because it is $70. So I don't want to waste my money. Window Vacuum Cleaner. That is something that I didn't even know existed. There's also a Spin Mop Set for $24.99 and a Spin Sweeper Set for $12.99. TikTok toilet brush. Anybody else get like inundated with videos of that? Lots of random kitchen stuff like this over the sink caddy, disposal pods to make your drain smell good, trash bag rim, and a soap dispenser. I definitely have my eye on this air mattress for $39.99. Some comfy throw blankets. I like those patterns that are in the back. Two different comforter sets. They come in a king and a queen size. They also have sheet sets, which I was considering because they say they're temperature controlled, so I don't know. I had to do a double take when I saw the price on these pillows. They are only $6.99. Berber and plush area rugs. I could not believe these are only $29.99. They also had bathroom rug sets in a couple different colors. They come with a toilet rug and the bigger rug. Whatever these are for $3.99 in a pack. Okay, so I also have my eye on this puzzle organizer. I didn't realize it was so gigantic. It's $24.99. It could be very useful because there's also a lot of puzzles out this week. I definitely want this one because we are planning our wedding in Italy. These plants were actually really nice. I don't know what they are, but they look really cute and they're a good size. Random toys and games this week, like the scented Squishmallows. Really cute puzzle sets that come in this little box. I didn't even look at this when I was at the store. I didn't realize what it is, but it's actually really cool. 4D puzzle. They have a couple different Lego sets. Look at this burger truck, that's so funny. Some more organizational stuff, like this woven organizer. For some reason, rolling carts are always so expensive, but this one's only $29.99. 50 pack of velvet hangers for $16.99. Random reading glasses with a case. The most adorable spring hangers hair accessories. I love all these colors. Not a headband person, but I'm going to try this one. Some umbrellas that had a push button. Those were actually really nice. Three new Febreze scents. I was spraying these all over the aisle. People were probably getting mad, but they smell so good. 
I also love these little diffuser sets. I bought two of them for $6.99. They're really nice. Essential oil sprays. Just beware if you have pets. All of these are toxic to your pets, so don't spray them. Fancy dental care box. They had a toothpaste. They had these little toothpicks. And then they also had a toothbrush that had charcoal. I am going to try that. They have a few men's clothes this week. They were also supposed to have a couple women's clothes, but I didn't see them. They also had these joggers that were kind of like a bathing suit material. It was very weird, but I bought them for Eric, so I hope he likes them. There's my little box of goodies. I'll see you next week. Bye.